who tore this country down, no one stood up to him. Nobody. Because he was black. You need to wake up. My parents didn't teach me that I was a victim. They can turn back voting rights. Didn't nobody donate to us the right to vote? Right? Your house, nigga. I didn't call you a nigga. Oh, okay. That, that's a big difference. Right. Yeah, Uncle Tom. And Uncle Tom is somebody who has sold out by embracing the white man. Uncle Tom. Bedwench. Boot liquor. Black white supremacist. Chucking and jiving. House Negro. Coon. Uncle Tom. Coon. Coon. I have a Coon Award over there. Coon of the Year Award. Most black people don't believe that other blacks can be independent free thinkers. I believe the legacy and the ancestry of black Americans is being insulted every single day. I will not pretend to be a victim in this country. I know that that makes many people on the left uncomfortable. Racist, racist, racial, racist, racism. A thousand cuts of racism. The liberal will try to control a black person through the concept of racism because they know that we are very proud, emotional people. I never felt that because I was black or I was poor or or a woman that I couldn't do something. I grew up being told of my disadvantages, that this country is unfair to black people. The ideology is implanted into you subconsciously to believe these things. It's like a cancerous plague in the mind of black Americans. We're brainwashed to think, well, is it because I'm black? America's not ours, or we got shipped here, no. Our blood is on this soil. We own this too. There should be a pride that we have in the fact that this country was built by many great black men and women. Are you trying to say that this country does not specialize in racism and bigotry? So long as black people continue to have their psyche filled by that nonsense, we won't have an awakening.